Now we want to know the tools of measuring length. So first thing is ruler. For example, this one, a half meter rule. This one, a measuring tape, which can measure up to 10 meters. So the very first kind of tool is ruler. Normally ruler can have a precision or can measure up to 0.1 cm which is also 1 mm. So if you are using meter, meter rule or ruler, your reading will be one, for example, 1.76 meter or 17.6 cm. That's the most accurate number you can get if you're using a ruler or a measuring tape. Okay, the second measuring tool is external calipers. An external caliper or internal caliper, they look like over here, this form. They have two drawers. Okay, over here, there are drawers. How you use it? You can clip the item you want to measure in between and maintain the distance over here. Use a ruler to measure the distance over here. Let's say it's called D1. So after you clip your item, you take the caliper away using a ruler to measure so that you can get the length. Since actually your measurement is still done by ruler or meter rule or half meter rule, so the precision level is still up to 0.1 cm. The next one, Vernier caliper. The graph shown over here, this one is actually a top view of a side view of Vernier caliper. It has inner draws, outer draws, so it has a main scale and a vernier scale. Okay, so how we use it? Similarly, we just clip our item over here. If say we are going to measure the external, for example, if I measure the diameter of, let's say, let's measure the thickness of my half, half meter rule. So what I'm going to do is take out my volley caliper, open up the drawers, and I clip my half meter rule. There's a top button over here. You can screw it to tighten up to make sure the reading never changed. So once I clip, I get my reading, I screw up, tighten, I can finally read from my vernier caliper. Instead of measure the external distance or the diameter itself, I can also measure the internal distance using the inside draw. So same. If, for example, I want to measure the internal diameter of this cylinder shaped tube. Okay, so I open up. Instead of clipping the tube, I use the internal draw to clip the in between. And similarly, I can tighten up and, my, and I get my readings of the internal diameter of a measuring tube. Okay? So that's how we use it. Then after we get the readings, how are we supposed to read from the vernier caliper? 